and shake off the attentions of out the door back in second, now just a length of drift. Dave Keane is on the one in front, but he's been pressed by Ken Whelan and the green and white colours on the outside, racing for home now. It's a little between Old Flaherty's Babe and been pressed on the outside by out the door. Faggy staying at it back in third. Neck and neck as they race towards the next. Old Flaherty's Babe with a neck advantage, but out the door challenging on the outside. Now, John, Old Flaherty's Babe is gone. This leads out the door with Fahagig flying at the finish as they race for home. Out the door being pressed by Fahagig now takes it up as they race up towards the line. It's Fahagig who came from way out to pace with Pat Graffin. Came with a very well-timed challenge tucked in behind O'Flaherty's babe who fell and out the door up. Fahagig wins it to notch up the first win of the season for the partnership of Jerry Cully and Paddy Graffin from out the door. Back in third is Lord Vic. And them. Kate's Castle in for Kevin. After these comes uh, over again and, and Fozzie's first and Desmond's gold. Willie Gleeson, however, has set sail for home on the one in front from Kate's Castle for Kevin. Inder Balger now trying hard to get on terms as they race downhill with one fence to jump. It was Yuffie's delight from Kate's Castle and improving for Kevin. They were drawing away from Fozzie's first and Desmond gold. Yuffie's delight then. The others have got much closer. That includes the grey horse with the light blue colours who's got within the length of the one in front. Now a battle between these two as they draw about four lengths clear at Kate's Castle. Ender Balger's got the inside berth as they race for home. Good piece of riding this one out of the former champion jockey as they race for home. It's for Kevin. However, on the outside, Yuffie's Delight will not give up as they race towards the final fence. For Kevin, however, has a length advantage. Coming back, however, was Yuffie's Delight a mistake by the grey. Yuffie's Delight now back in the head of affairs, but he's been pressed again by For Kevin. It's going to be very close between the two of them. Yuffie's Delight been pressed all the while by For Kevin, who just might not be on terms as they race towards the line. Still neck and neck. For Kevin it is, who gets back after making a mistake to win it as they race up towards the line. For Kevin, from Yuffie's Delight and Kate's Castle. A good finish, but For Kevin wins it. Drum Gorilla Ed who comes to take it up again at this one. Drum Gorilla Ed again gets very close to the fence. Mistake almost on shipping behind was a uh, fresh lady. Drum Gorilla Ed leads, however. Didn't jump the one below me well, but comes towards this one, getting a reminder from the jockey. Now jumps it better from Camerhoo Lady as they race for home. Drum Gorilla Ed leads. Looking back, Tom Lumbert in second and Camerhoo Lady as they race downhill. Drum Gorilla Ed by four lengths from Camerhoo Lady, then Don't comes Fresh Lady on the cards as Camerhoo Lady comes on the outside to spew with Drum Gorilla Ed as they race towards it. Drum Gorry Lad has been passed on the outside by Camero Lady with one fence to jump. Over it, Camero Lady makes a mistake to leave Drum Gorry Lad get back almost in terms of the race for home. Drum Gorry Lad on the inside now of Camero Lady as the race up towards the line. Drum Gorry Lad has got his neck in front as the race for home. Camero Lady is coming back at him, however, as the race towards the line. Drum Gorry Lad now moving again away from Camero Lady. After these comes Fresh Lady racing up towards the line. A good win for the Monkstown Egan stable. Drum Gorry Lad from Camero Lady who made a mistake. At the last fresh lady finishing back in third. And on the outside as they race for home. Kilana last being pressed by the pale blue colours on the outside of Hannigan who comes to take it up. John London doesn't finish, however, and Glitzy Lady as they race for home. A Hannigan leading. From on the inside, uh, Kilana last staying at it. Glitzy Lady between horses, a definite second now as they race with one fence to jump. Glitzy Lady comes to challenge. A hand again as they draw away from uh, Kilana last. Over it comes a hand again from Glitzy Lady, a length to drift. A long run up towards the line. A hand again, however, leading from Glitzy Lady. Staying at it back behind them is three buds as he passes Kilana last for third. Racing up towards the line. A hand again, Glitzy Lady staying at it. Three adrift, however, in second. Putting away from three buds up towards the line. Comes a hand again from Glitzy Lady. After these comes three buds, uh, the Ladies' Quest and Kalanalas.